things. So many things. But ever since I was a kid, like I could walk into a room. You know how like if you go to someone's house and their dog growls and they're like, ooh. Some people are like, if their dog growls at somebody, there's not good energy there. This might sound really weird. But when I was a kid, like I could walk into a room and I'd be like, something ain't right. And if this was my mom, like I would be like this. Would not leave her side. My brother, who is, where's my brother at, by the way? He's right there. <laughs> my brother would, my brother would go play, like he would go play with people. And I'd be like, deuces, I'll see you when we get back home. Like, I'm not. And I just, this, and like, I didn't know until later, actually until I started doing what I do, is that, like, I feel what's going on in the room. It sounds so weird. Like, I don't think that I, I'm, like, telepathic or in a medium or anything like that. But I can feel it. So when I started teaching, and like, and two months after I started teaching, people were coming to me like, oh my God, like, you completely changed my life. And I'm like, really? And I get that a lot. I got that like two months after I started teaching, new to aerobics. And then I, later in life, obviously, when I got older, I think, I'm, I think I realize what it is. And it's that you don't understand. Like, I feel what you need. Like when I come in here, when I go to teach a class, like it's never about me. Like you can ask them. I did my workout while I was waiting to come in here. Because this is not my workout. Like I have to the sweat that you see is like everything that I have to do to make sure that you get the greatest experience possible. And I can't come out and touch each and every one of you. Like you obviously that's impossible. But like I hope you feel that what we're doing and the reason why you came here and the reason why you made love insanity or you were driven to push yourself today is just, it's really about you. And I feel that, like, I never get that crazy when I teach. I mean, I get crazy, obviously. Woo! Woo! And so when I'm doing the DVDs and, and things like that, like, what's happening in my mind is, I go back, like, when every DVD that I shoot, I go back and I think about what does, the, what does that person need? So when I was, when I was teaching a live class one day, and I'm like, okay, this is how I'm feeling right now in the workout. And there's someone that's doing this workout that needs me to say this. They need me to say this right now because I know if I'm feeling like this, you gotta be feeling like that. Or you felt like that before you surpassed that part of your plateau. So everything that I do is like really from feelings. So I just, the reason why I'm telling you this, the reason why I'm rambling, is because like, like, I feel that in this room, there's like a lot of energy. There's a lot of pride. There's a lot of, maybe it's not working out. Maybe it's a connection from you with somebody else. Like, I met a young lady, what's your name again? Mahe. Mahe. Hey. Just in a grocery store in Maui the other day. And I was like, oh my God. And there was something that, like, usually I meet people, I'm like, hi, how are you? And, you know, I'm like, oh, nice to meet you. And then I go on to do what I need to do. But for some reason, I was like, I felt the need to hang out with her for a couple minutes. I was like, I introduced her to the whole family. I was like, this is my mother and father-in-law, this is my husband, this is who, who else is with us, my brother and Nicole. And I don't know, it's just like, so I feel like there's things that, the reason why that drove me here today is you must have touched somebody or you must feel touched or you must feel like you want to push harder. And I'm just telling you this so that whatever you do, in your workout or whatever you do in your life, it's just that, like you have to live. And the way that you live is completely be authentic to who you are and take that energy and that power that makes you push play one more day when you really don't have to and filter it into your life because that's the feeling that's gonna make this a lifestyle for you. So keep it up, keep up the good work and we're gonna do a Q&A, all right? So thank you very much. That's the end of the workout. Um, I'm gonna go change because I'm disgusting. Um, I'm gonna go change.